What's up guys, in this video we're going to discuss how we have redesigned this product page for this skincare brand and we're going to discuss everything that we have applied to increase the conversion rate and this video is going to be especially important for you if you run Facebook ads because you're going to see what are the best practices for optimizing your product page for the Facebook ads traffic. The first thing that we have here is that we have added this announcement bar, free shipping on orders over $80. This is very good and especially if you have it in your car drawer, like some upsells and order incentives to increase increase their AOV so they can reach that free shipping threshold so this will help you a lot with increasing your AOV then the next thing that we have here and this is the thing that most of you guys don't do at all it's the text on the image in this example we have the best seller on this image you can have something like viral on TikTok best rated and all these things so this is really good because like in this image there's real estate that could be used and we used it to have this text on it instead of having it somewhere here where we have saved our real state for other things we have put the best seller here in the image so that therefore it increases the conversion rate as it communicates that other people are buying this product as well so i would highly suggest you to test having text in your images that will help either clarify your product or increase the perceived value then the next thing that we have here is that we have added this save amount a lot of you guys only cross the old price and put the new price but if you have this box saying save five pounds and it exactly tells how much your customer is saving that way it, your offer will look more appealing they will not have to calculate themselves how much they are saving it will increase the perceived value and therefore more people will buy from you then the next thing that we have here and this is super important it's called the value proposition it says reduce face puffiness in 30 seconds and this is the thing where we are pairing our facebook ad with our product page as you can see in the facebook ad it also states this benefit this value proposition reduce face puffiness in 30 seconds you can see how the product page is congruent how the colors are consistent and you can see the promise that we have in our ad we have it as well in the product page we want to maintain that consistency between these two when they click on this ad they expect this benefit as well on your product page and for that reason it's really important that you maintain that consistency between your ad and your landing page so that they get what they expect on your product page so very important thing then the next thing that we have here we have these trust seals right below the add to cart you can see we have five day delivery natural extracts 30 day returns this is also very important and this is called the CTA anchoring that way you communicate your offer you are saying as well that delivery is quick which reduces the friction you're as well saying that there's a 30 day returns in case they don't like the product they can just just like easily return it and it helps increasing the conversion rate because it decreases how much it costs your customer to buy from you they have the guarantee they will not wait too long so this is very important thing to have on your product page then the next thing that we have here just below default is the credibility seals we have other companies that are talking about this product and if these well-known companies are talking about this product that means that this product works well that means it's popular so if any brands or magazines or platforms are talking talking about your product you should have that as a credibility seal it will help you with increasing your conversion rate so then the next thing that we have here we have videos on how to use because they have been getting a lot of questions on how to use this product and we have taken that into account we have reviewed their customer support tickets and stuff they have even asked how to use this product before buying it so for that reason it means that it's something that's important to these customers so for that reason the best way to communicate how to use it is through videos so as you can see we have three simple steps where you click on each video and it plays how to use this product so it's like completely clear how to use it and therefore there's no friction when they're buying this product this is the case where you are seeing what your customers are constantly asking you on your support ticket and therefore you just gather that information and put it on your product page so then the next thing that we have here is more benefits the main benefit that we're going for is reducing the face puffiness and that's the benefit that pairs with the facebook ad but there's also some other benefits that might be beneficial to these customers and we have pointed these out in these sections more ways to use this ice cube this also helps with increasing the perceived value because they know that they will not be able only to use it to reduce the face puffiness they will also use it to detoxify their skin anti-aging and all these things right then we have reviews this is like pretty usual i guess all of you guys have reviews then we have faqs there's a lot of questions before buying the product so we have these questions once again and we put it on the product page so that it answers all these questions we always put the most frequent one as first then the second 
second one, then third one. So very important thing, especially if you're selling to the skincare niche. And the last thing that we have here is related products. You always want to have related products because that's kind of a down selling thing. If they don't like this product, they might like some other products and you want to use that opportunity to sell them other products so that you still get a chance to sell them something in case they don't buy your first product. So that's it for this video. I hope you found it useful. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments. And if you'd like to work with my agency where we will help you with increasing your conversion rate, check the link down below and like and subscribe if you like more content like this. And if you like this video and you'd like to see more content where I'm breaking down how we have improved the conversion rate, check the next video that I will have on this end screen.